Hi everyone, it's Andrea. I'm just going to do a quick flip through of uh, Grayscale Fairies by Jade Summer. Now, this has been out a while and I'm sure most of you have seen it, but I haven't really looked through it yet, so this is the best way for me to look through the pictures as well. So I do believe there's two of each in this one, 25 probably, and so 50 in total. So let's have a quick look, see what we think. That's a nice one, I like that one. I really like the way that Jade Summer do their grayscale. I've got their Unicorns grayscale book on order. So I think that's coming next week, I hope. So everything's a bit slow because of the uh, current situation, but I'm happy with that as long as I get it. I'm not that worried. Um, that's quite a cute one, an apple and a strawberry and the fairies in the fields. A fairy and the unicorn, that's quite nice. And holding a dying fairy. I'd say she's upset because the fairy's dying. Not that she's hurt it herself, because she's crying, so. Um, that one's showing off. They, they are beautiful images. Oh, that's lovely, that one. Oh, that one's stealing an egg. That's not so good. The detail on some of these is really pretty. That one's quite nice. She's having a cup of tea. She's even got a pair of slippers there. That's <laughs> quite sweet. Oh, that one is stunning. I think I'm going to do this one first. I just think it looks lovely. I think I can use some glitter pens on it, on all the droplets and the moon, and it'll just look stunning. So, oh yes, I've got to do that one. I'll keep this book for this month, I think. Cute. Ah, uh, that's the one that Anne did on A Colourful Life. I remember watching it, her do that one. That's why I wanted to get this book. Oh, that's cute. What's the front one? Okay. That one's nice as well. They all are, they are all very, very sweet, these pictures. beautiful sitting on a skull I actually quite like that one I would though I'm a bit strange oh that's sweet look the little animals she's sitting on the animal on the rabbit very very cute so the thing with the flip throughs is they're not very long Bears. That's quite a nice one with the dragon. I'm not a big dragon person, I know lots of people love dragons, I'm just not. But that doesn't mean I'm not going to enjoy colour in it, because I probably will. Oh, that's adorable! Little fairy in a teacup! Oh, I'm going to have to do that one as well. Definitely. That is so sweet. That fairy's got a fish in her hand. That's not very nice. Not sure whether she's trying to cover the bird up or whether she's distracting it so she can steal an egg as well. Some of these fairies are a bit naughty, aren't they? So sweet. They're really nice pictures. They're well drawn. I will give that. To them. Uh, that fairy's um, making that little bunny rabbit fly. Okay. Oh, that's a nice one. The first one again. Oh, God, I can't even see. No. We can't be far off, though. Yeah, that's the first one again. So those are all the pictures. These are all another set of duplicates, so you can do them twice. And obviously the back has a few of the images. So you do get two sets in some of these books, which is great because 
it means you can colour well with markers and well with pencils and practice your grayscale in either markers or in um, pencil, however you want to do it. So that's the Grayscale Colouring Book Fairies by Jade Summer. I do love their grayscale and I wish I hadn't bought all the line art ones now they're bringing them all out in grayscale because I think I'd prefer them but it is what it is. That doesn't mean to say that I won't get the grayscale versions of vampires and things like that. It's just not going to be a priority because I've already got the line art version and I do like the line art version. Sometimes I like to do a bit of extra blending and, and trying to you know do all that with especially with the skin. Um, but yeah I'm looking forward to colouring in that one so I'll be colouring that one hopefully in April. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.